Today I'm going to show you real quick how we want to export to DXF for a sticker. So I've got a quick design right here. I'm going to want to send this over to the vinyl cutter, but to do that it has to be a DXF. So the first thing that I want to do is make sure all my lettering is exploded. Uh, if it is in a text format, it will not work. So all the lettering exploded, all one layer, you shouldn't have any duplicate lines. So here we go. So first thing we'll do is go up to File, Export Selected. I'm going to select everything I want to send, right click. Now we're going to put it somewhere. Well, we save it in the uh, desktop for be shared, uh, stickers, and the first one you all are going to do is white. We want to make sure you put your name, the size that you expect it to be, and the color. That way if it's in the wrong folder, I can fix it. Here's the most important part. We're going to change this 3DM to DXF. And when you do this, the first time you're going to go Options, change this from Default to 2007 Polylines. You're going to Edit, go to Curves, and you will see that this is checked. We want to uncheck that. We don't want to explode all of our poly curves. So I'm going to go Save, Close. Always use this whenever we're doing DXF. Go ahead and hit OK on that, and Save. That will now be exported in the format that I can open up on the vinyl cutter, and I can make your sticker.